Hello gang, what's going on? So I'm gonna be quick because um my noodles just finished and um yeah my shrimp are not boiling. What's the S word? There. They're cooking. Anyway, um I am 16 weeks today and not only do I am I starting to look pregnant but I feel it and when I say I feel it I feel it um am I tired no but I get sleep spells out of nowhere my breast we're still gonna have a video about that we we have to have a full conversation about that because it makes no sense um I don't want y'all to like weirdly stare at my breast right now but if you know for the ones who didn't know me before um the channel i was in a cup as you can see they look like freaking water balloons right now I'm, I'm probably a c cup and they're as heavy as a newborn baby each one of them um cravings to get to the noodles all i crave hot and spicy noodles with extra hot sauce and seasoning salt and I am still on my seafood, y'all. I can't get away from it. I crave it so bad. And we are going to Juicy Crab very, very soon because I have to get my seafood fixed or I'm going to go crazy. I do watch Be Love every night. If I could watch her for hours, I probably would. Or I know for sure that I would. But I have kind of went from watching seafood mukbangs to watching hot and spicy noodle mukbangs and i'm guessing that's because that's what i crave at the moment um i also am craving burgers before pregnancy i did not eat burgers of course i used to eat burgers probably a while back but before pregnancy i'm I, everywhere we go i'm getting chicken a chicken uh sandwich i'm not getting a burger and burgers just that wasn't my thing fried chicken no unless i had a hangover um let me see what else is going on week 16. um can't breathe now that's getting worse for me to breathe man i just can't I, you know i'm only 16 weeks guys i had like 24 25 ago and um i already can't breathe so i can only imagine how it's going to get when i am in my third trimester um i know that i have a healthy baby because the button is growing by the way button is once again um what we call my unborn child or our unborn child um my mother took me yesterday to go to get maternity clothes now once again first pregnancy so i'm thinking you don't get maternity clothes until you're like you know about 23 24 weeks no it's time now at 16 weeks um before pregnancy i was a size 13 in pants no longer okay um i got a lot of maternity pants the ones with the stretchy um band attached to them the full stretch band can't wait to wear them y'all because i am about to get rid of jeans i don't like the way they feel i don't like clothes period i don't like shoes on my feet but of course for work and outings i have to have on clothes so i got some um maternity shirts now what i was we wasn't arguing but you know what i was conversing with my mom about was mom i can just wear like extra large t-shirts instead of buying these 13 dollar maternity shirts from target and she said absolutely not there's a huge difference and you can tell when on the body of a pregnant woman you can tell when she has on a maternity shirt versus a t-shirt and you know she not gonna let me go out like that so 
with that being said i got some maternity shirts as well t-shirts and you know some little cute date night shirts um i am still trying to sleep on my stomach but it's getting bad because of my breast so you know i'm moving all night long i use the bathroom probably matter of fact i have a bathroom schedule um my body has become accustomed to it therefore it doesn't matter if i don't drink a drop of water versus drinking three bottles of water i'm using the bathroom four times in during uh throughout the night and at work throughout the day probably about four times as well so it's just you just got to get up and go okay um i don't do exercising i don't exercise to be honest you know, probably walking the parking lot and walking through Walmart is about all I got right now. Um, if necessary, I will. I don't eat a lot, so I haven't gained a lot of weight at all. Um, but, you know, I'm just getting used to it. Back pains. Oh, it's cruciating. And I'm not doing this and saying this to scare you know, expecting mothers or mothers uh, or women who want to become mothers. Of course, this is not a scare tactic. It's not a what? Tactic. Absolutely not. This is just real life, real time. I'm pregnant. It's my first pregnancy. My freaking breasts hurt. And it's just some things that you are going to have to prepare for. And, you know, mood swings. I was asked about my mood swings. I don't think I had mood swings in the first trimester. However, we will be doing a video on that with um, my child's father. And he will be able to explain if he feels as though I had mood swings. I think I was chilling. You know, honestly, I think he, he is and was. When I say is, I mean to this day, is the pregnant one. So, um... You know, I think it's it's starting to switch over now to where I'm actually carrying and I'm actually having those, the full pregnancy right now. But who knows, next week it'll be something else with him. Anyway, so yeah, I have to get to my noodles. If y'all want to see me, because I heard that I'm the noodle queen, okay? Not trying to step on anybody's toes who been, you know, who know how to sit noodles in a microwave and mix them up but what i'm saying is from my family from a lot of people i'm the noodle queen okay i actually did a facebook live making noodles and let me tell you i'm surprised it didn't go viral okay um but yes and if you do want to see what i do because you cannot have but 20 ounces of seafood per week um Preferably, that's really actually um, from doctors. Doctors will tell you that. Um, because I crave it so much, watching it doesn't really do it for me, you know, because I want it. I want to taste it. I want to, I want to actually let button, you know, get some of that. But it's not as healthy. It's not as unhealthy as a lot of people think. Fish, that's a different story, you know. But when it comes down to shrimp and crab legs and stuff like that what i do to um calm my my craving is i actually cook or boil potatoes and maybe shrimp i try not to throw shrimp in there but boiled eggs y'all oh my we have to talk about boiled oh we will get to that next video once again Gotta get to my food. I'm not rushing y'all. Comment, comment, comment. Make sure you are sharing. Make sure you are subscribing. If you have not subscribed already, let me know. I did um, read comments on the last video stating that y'all would like for me to actually show my full pregnancy, meaning vlog through my full pregnancy. And I'm going to try my best. And I'm going to do better with being consistent and showing y'all what's really going on, okay? but it's real life, real time. And hope to hear from y'all. Have a good one.